What's that? Alright guys, I'm going to shoot a just a little quick video here because uh, I'm kind of glad I just finished something here. Uh, so, just catch up what my idea is. A couple uh, videos back or something. I'm under the weather, so I hope you can understand me. But anyway, you know, <clears throat> I saw a video or somewhere I got into a discussion about how this little ad uh, was sort of history in the making. People that are around didn't even know it. You know. So what this ad did was uh, in 19, what is this, 85, they put out that you could uh, order this Dark Knight Returns. And the price tag on it was $2.95 uh, a copy. And comics were 75 cents on the newsstand back then. So I remember everybody kind of thinking, oh wow, you know, that's a, that's a whole lot for a comic book. And, you know, I didn't know anybody had ordered it. Well, what, you know, came out was, you know, they're not Dark Knight Returns. And, uh, show you the covers. And, uh, you know. So, you know, we all know what, what happened there, you know. Frank Miller became a super, superstar. And Batman got, you know, he just back. Led to the movie and led to the cartoon. But uh, I always kind of wondered, you know, what if, what if. So, I want you to look at the ad one more time. Okay. And here's what I finished. Let's see, there we go. One Man Army Corps returns. Zomac and Commandians, you've never seen them before. That's a comic I'd want to see. Like I said, I'm just more glad I finished it than anything. Alright, so... I know what I'm going to do, but what I'm kind of wondering is uh, what if we took each cover and we pretended it was OMAC Returns. You know, I'm figuring this one could be a silhouette of, of OMAC. This could be OMAC. Torn all the crap. Little Commandy running down here with the big brother eye symbol. But then I get here, and who could this be if this was OMAC? Who would this be? So I can do like a mock-up cover. And if there's anybody out there that wants to you know, grab onto these and make a little video, definitely let me know if you do it. I want to see it. Alright, guys. But like I said, this is by far, you know, the first time I ever used ink. You know, it's not the best picture in the world. But uh, I'm kind of proud of it. All right, so give me some thoughts. You know, you think this would have been something you would have bought? Do you think uh, doing the other covers is worth it? And anybody out there want to pop up and try to do one? Or is there any other kind of uh, what if kind of things uh, they'd like to see done? Because you know, there's a lot of classic series out there who maybe you plugged in another character. Could that have been cool? All right, thanks a lot, guys.